I'm gonna show you guys how to take off an ECU on a 2017 and newer G6R1000. First, we're gonna take off the lovely rear seat. And then we're gonna proceed to take off our side tank covers. So essentially the only tools you're gonna need is a little pick, six inch extension, five millimeter Allen, four millimeter Allen, and a Phillips screwdriver. So we're gonna take the little side tank covers off. Pull it from the bottom, pull it from the top, and then the left right there. We do that on both sides. Take off the two five millimeters on the seat. And then take your seat off. And then take off the two mil five millimeters at the very back. Then we switch to the four. There's two on each side right here. And then there's two right here. Now we're gonna switch to our pick. We have two push pins right here, and then we have four on the bottom. They're really easy. You can use a little flat blade too, however you wanna do it. They don't require a lot of force, so don't break them, they break. Very easy, very fragile. Like this one looks like it's on its last leg maybe, and out. it's good. All right. Then pull here, pull on this side. All right, and the whole thing unlocks at the bottom. All right. There's two little Phillips screwdriver heads. Take one off right there. Move your power cable over. Take off the second one. All right. Then what I like to do is I like to unplug the starter solenoid. Pop off, slide it off. Just kind of pulls right off. And that way you have full access to your ECU. Next thing we're gonna do is you push the pin right here and then slide the lever. Disengages the first one, same thing with the second one. And there's the ECU. 